Hello and welcome back to Aardvark Games and today we are gonna start a new series so we are starting a uh, space engineer survival series and our little scenario is our mining vessel that we were all on mining cargo hauling vessel that we were on has been hit by space pirates and forced to crash land on uh, a relatively unknown uncharted planet in an unknown system we were just kind of jumping our way across um, and so here we are the escape pods have been jettisoned so hopefully the crew has survived spread out not exactly sure where or how many have survived we will just have to see how all that goes and so this is just kind of where we're at. We've been been uh, playing on a different server for sure and um, just kind of took one of our ships from there and crash landed it in a new server, unknown system, and it's time to get it going and see what we do. Um, server does have a host of mods. We'll get a list put in the description or something for all the mods. There are several and... Uh, so with that, let's get going. Alright, first things first. Let's see how bad the damage is. Oh, there we go. There's got to be the moon. Enemy feeling station on our doorstep. Uh, we do have oxygen. The temperature is cold. One of our mining ships on its head lots of fire and a whole back end explosion of the ship so that's a bit of a rough one it was a faithful ship one of our first builds actually yeah, but it's always served the purpose and done its job real well so I haven't really replaced it either now unfortunately crashed so it looks like we did have two of small ships that have survived the crash and a large one that definitely did not so okay I have to figure out how a hydrogen is going to be a thing is it still working all right that's still working so we need to find that's obviously tied into a generator. Can we get in here? Is this gonna work? No. Alright, so the conveyor system definitely broken. Alright, let's get rid of some of the fires to start with. That's going to be crazy. Wow, that created a crater in there for sure. So, Alright, got that down. Always an interruption. We'll get going. Alright, inventory is full, of course. Well, at least the survival. At least the survival kit got tipped down, so it's easy to refill on the ground. Or, or is definitely broken. No more or detector. Is that out? All right, that takes care of most of the fire. It looks like it. We generally could probably power down. Well, I guess we really can't just power down this ship. All right, we're going to have to figure out how to get to one of the hydrogen producers, though. Or we're not going to have... That's going to be horrible. All right. And to be honest, this ship is so old. Are any of these hydrogen bottles that made it? No. Only oxygen bottles. 
Uh, any hydrogen? No, we got a bunch of empties. Hmm. Did the O2 generators survive? The O2 generators survived. But well, we can't put anything in them. So, oh, the conveyors are messed up. Yeah, right. I'm trying to figure out where they're messed up is like never going to happen. Okay. That, 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 that. Oh, if this works, that's a jackpot. Why can't I put them in there? Alright, that's not broken. Can I get a cargo? I don't even know. If I could get a cargo container to sit on there. No, any interior plate, of course. Well, we got tons of interior plate. I just gotta figure out a way to get to the H2O. Or, not the H2O, but hydrogen and oxygen, because I am gonna need to fill bottles if I'm gonna fly around, that's for sure. Interior plate. Oh, uh, whatever, man. Do we have any interior plate? Yes, we have lots of interior plate. Should have lots of stuff. This ship's always been loaded in one of our resource ships, so I don't anticipate we're like running out of anything anytime soon. Though at least we do have a miner that survived, it looks like. But no real way to get around, although I don't know, it depends on how much damage is done to the ships. Might be able to just actually go fly around some. Although getting that miner off its head might be a bit of a pain. Now let's see, does this work? No, for some reason you still won't feed down to the... Okay. Fine, I got a better plan then. Everything is full. Alright, why can't I? I'll tell you what I can do. Yeah, I know. Feels low. Wonder if I can just build a brand new one. As long as it's still got power before this thing dies. Why not? And then grab some ice and just put it in there. That might work. Uh, actually, I just need an O2 generator. Still haven't been playing this game that long. I got some. I got. I do have a fair amount of time in it, but really have not been playing. I've been playing on a survival world with um, a lot of guys that really actually know what they're doing, and so that's made life a lot simpler for me, for sure. This is going to kind of be a adventure to start, and just hope that the rest of the crew shows up or has survived the crash and makes it to the new, uh, what? So there's just something broken, I gotcha. There is just something completely broken in the conveyor system, which makes sense. The ship is smashed to pieces. This is a problem I've never dealt with, uh, so. All right. Inventory full. That's fine. 
That's what I want. Oh, it totally exploded and it's not very happy sitting there. Look at that. The ice is spinning everywhere. Oh, are you kidding? My inventory. This is going to be weird because definitely used to playing with a bigger inventory. We've had inventory levels like ever since I started playing the inventory level was jacked way up. So smaller inventories <clears throat> kind of playing with most or much lower, you know, settings of things. Maybe it'll be a little bit harder. That's kind of the idea. I should get rid of this and see what happened. Where'd it go? Oh lord. Alright, there it is. So at least it didn't go too far. Let's see if we can get this to work. If we can solve one problem. Alright, check that out. One problem absolutely solved. So there's a winner. Alright, let's see if we can go pick up some of this mess. Now that we actually have some flight capability. Jeez. This is gonna be an interesting start to say the least. Oh yeah. I can barely pick up anything. No, you can't you don't wanna store all that stuff. This stuff. Hopefully you can shove it in the connector. Uh, I think we're just mainly going to scavenge this ship for parts and pieces and see what we can get out of it. Should at least enable us to start, you know, a base landing pad. I don't know, but then we got hostels right over the way. So that's going to kind of be interesting to see how that goes. All right, what happened to that other bottle? Probably playing to the moon too or what? Alright, well I don't see it. We'll grab at least one more trip of ice. Inventory full. Inventory full. Yeah, definitely. Alright, a little more destruction to the ship. No big deal. What? You're flying to the wrong connect. That's going to be habit. Alright. Here we go. Really need to just turn around and grind this off of here and let and let the um hydrogen where's all the hydrogen wells. Alright. There we go. Groovy. Let's get these in here so we have a supply. There. That will do that. Not sure exactly how we're going to shoot all this stuff, being the length of videos and stuff like that. Definitely play a lot more. So we'll just kind of have to see, keep everything updated. It's a new adventure. Hopefully, people stick with it with the channel and tend to just do the railroads thing. But. Trying to branch out a little bit more and cover something else, so... Alright, let's see if we can turn the dampeners off. Do have to say, I really enjoy this game. We will get to space, we'll do lots of building, lots of, uh, you know, engineering, if you will. All kinds of different things. These are a couple of the ships that I've built already. A little scout ship and uh, a little miner from our old server chassis sharing kind of ships lightweight equipment but does the job pretty well so at least a couple of those survived this wow man this thing used to have like six large ion thrusters on the back all gone that's a complete mashup so we'll just have to see this big gigantic hole I don't even remember, couldn't even tell you what was in here. I gotta assume, probably reactors, there's one, so I would assume those at least came back one more. It was probably a reactor explosion, took out that whole section. Lost more than a few of the jump drives, looks like. Not sure. Yeah, it looks like a few. Four of them made it through anyway, so it isn't like they all totally went 
gone, but it, that stuff will all get ground up now. Anyway, or detector, things like that. Alright, let's see, how did you come out? This thing doesn't look like... It must have bounced. Whoa! Just about started grinding. <laughs> no, grind up one of the only assets. Alright, that one should be alright. This one is totally on its head. And I can't imagine that you're just gonna roll over without. Yeah, no chance. Uh oh. Let's just not break it. We'll just have to do something to flip it. Might be able to do some of that. Oh. oh. There's a big hole right in front of us. Definitely not. I don't know. Let's just shut it off and save power. If nothing else, we might just be able to flip that over with the other ship. These things aren't very heavy. And before we get shot up by that guy, we should probably go over there and see what that is. It says fueling station, which Lord knows we could use some fuel probably right about now. Alright. Are you still gonna fly? And are you functioning? All the lights are still on, that's kinda hilarious. Alright. Wait, wait, the scout made it? Great, the scout made it and the, the miners flipped up, so uh, perfect. Let's well, flip perfectly upside down, too, so. I don't know, you know what? There are other tricks to flip that over other than using the ship, so maybe I won't use the ship. No point in wrecking, the, wrecking them both. That would be my luck. Not exactly sure. I don't think we're gonna go mess with that one just yet. We kinda gotta get our footing first, so. Probably need some sort of a landing pad and antenna. I suppose nobody else is gonna be able to find, find our signals or anything else if we don't have one up. And apparently the I didn't see a signal on that when it was on. I didn't see one on there either. Alright. Not too, too damaged. So let's see if we can get that fixed. If we can get that going. If we can get that going, we can turn around and get the rest of these. We need to get these ion thrusters all shut off so that we don't waste power because I have no idea how much power this ship has left but I know this thing is nuclear powered so without it we are going to run out of juice so let's go in and see if we can turn all whoa wait a minute no Turn all of these off. There we go. That should save us a heck of a lot of power on the ship. Turn on our lights. It appears that we are in the dark. Light mod in the sky so we don't have the stock sky there. I wonder what planets those are. Huh. Gotta be assuming that's the moon, so. All right, well, I guess we have kind of taken stock of our situation, which is a heck of a crash site, and we will have to turn around and get our miner flipped 
back over, which we, we should be doing soon, and then we are going to have to go at whatever that is because we cannot be in the area. We don't need hostels in the area, and we definitely can't move our resources anytime soon. So we are kind of stuck here. So there is that, but I think... With that one, we're going to turn around and call it a uh, start to the series. Wait a minute. There's that. There's, wait. There's another one out there. Wow. Okay. So we definitely do have a crazy system. Look forward to seeing the plant. That'll be cool. Heck. we got a pretty good planetary view right here, I have to admit. Oh. Wait a minute. What the heck? Never even seen that before. What the heck was that? That's the one you wanted. All right. Well, there you go. So it looks like a planet, two moons, a moon, and I don't know what that is. Maybe that's just a second moon or something. Who knows? We'll have to figure that out when we get there. All right. So our antenna is up. Hopefully that'll start bringing in the crew. We will put out a mayday, mayday, and see if we have any survivors along the way but i think we're going to call that one a start say thanks for tuning in remember if you get a chance like share subscribe subscriptions are free but sure do help the channel and we'll see you on the next one